Fabs and welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are just joining me, my name is Elia Esparza and today I'm going to be reviewing the T3 curling iron. Okay, so I finally dove in. I finally purchased the T3 Twirl Trio and let me tell you, it does not, does not disappoint. I am obsessed with this T3. Now I have owned a T3 product before. I have a blow dryer, like a traveling one. And it honestly wasn't my favorite thing that I've ever bought, but this one. I am so excited to be talking about the T3 Twirl Trio today. We're gonna do a little tutorial. I'm gonna curl my hair. I'm gonna show you guys the differences of the barrels and we're gonna get into it. Before we begin, don't forget to like and subscribe and let's get this video started. So starting off with just like the product, I did order it from a local salon that I go to where I get my hair done with my girl Sam. The salon is called Your New Image and they do have it available on their website for way cheaper than it than it is on Ulta or on the 23 website or anywhere I've seen. So they have a really, really good price. I will link it down below if you guys are interested in using it. And it's so simple, you can just order it. They ship all over the US and it's very easy. I will also put the Amazon link, but like why would you, you wanna go cheaper, I mean. Put the Amazon one, but I would suggest getting it from your new image because it is cheaper, so that's just smarter. So it comes with three barrels. Basically, you can see the different sizes. Has kind of like a skinny one if you want like a tighter curl. Has this medium one if you want kind of like not too tight but not too loose either. And the big one, which is kind of the one that I pretty much use for my hair every single day just because I like that undone look but still put together if that makes sense so this is what it looks like it comes with the three barrels i do have it already charging or heating up i should say and this is the thickest barrel that it comes with pretty much i use every single day like this one's my favorite and i have tried the other two and i love them but i just for like an everyday beachy wave look that's my go-to then we do have the skinnier one this is for like that really tight curl. Like if you want like Susie Q curls, this is gonna be the look. It's also kind of fun to be able to like have some big pieces and some really tight pieces and have that mix. And then this is the medium sized one. Again, this one's really good also because I feel like my hair after a couple of days falls out. So if I really want it to last, I'll use this one so that it has like a tighter curl on the first day and then it kind of loosens up throughout the days that I'm not washing my hair. So this is what the T3 looks like. It has a little clamp right here so it doesn't touch your desk or your table when you're heating up. It has a clamp right here. And then all you have to do is press the button to light it up, to turn it on, and then you can hold it to change the amount of heat that you want. So it doesn't say the temperature of the heat, which is what I'm used to, but I'm totally fine with it. Usually I have it on the fourth setting of the heat. I know it's like super bright, so I don't know if you can see. But sometimes I'll even hold it up to the fifth one. I usually just keep it at four because I'm good to go with that one. It also gets hot really fast, which is convenient because I'm always on the go. So so I always like to put my hair half up. If you've seen any of my other hair tutorials, you know the drill, half up, half down. I start in the back. And what I like to do is grab a piece, go halfway down, hold it out, and so that the end is a little bit kept straight, so it's not completely a full-blown curl. You'll see what I mean in just a second. So I grab it, I twirl, and I kind of keep a little bit out you'll see for the added effect. <laughs> I don't even have to hold it too long, honestly. And then I kind of just inch my way down and that is the curl that I like to get. That kind of like simple, loose wave curl. Same thing, hold it a couple seconds, inch my way down and then just let it fall. So pretty. Also, it's like so smooth, which is really nice because I've used some curling irons that you just feel like it's like tugging and ripping out your hair. And this one is so smooth. It's honestly my favorite. I was using um, Hot Tools Professional, which is also another great brand. Look at that. Um, but I got that one stolen a couple months ago, so I just hadn't, I had a Revlon one that I was using, 
and it worked decently but once I finally purchased this one I was like wow I've been I've been missing out so I'm happy to have it now so this is the 1.25 inch barrel okay so there's the one and a half one inch and then the 1.25 or one three fourths, yeah. So as you can see, that's the first half compared to my straight hair. I do have naturally straight hair, like this is pretty much air dried from when I showered this morning. So I'm basically gonna repeat the process on the top, starting from the back, driving the piece, and just working its magic. Watch a break. <laughs> so definitely you can hold it out a little bit longer if you just want the curl to be a little tighter and that's just with any wand or curling iron. You just hold it out and it'll come out like a little bit more. As you can see, I held that one a little bit longer and it comes out very, very curled. I just love it because I feel like it's so smooth, like the barrel is so smooth on my hair and I'm literally doing all my hair, which I have a lot of hair, in like less than 10 minutes. So, it's amazing. <laughs> I always tend to curl away from my face. I know some people do kind of a mix and match of like some away, some towards their face, but I just found that away from my face works best in my experience, but maybe I'll get a little experimental. Yeah. love how just aesthetically pleasing T3 products are because they're like white with rose gold or a little bit of gold and I just feel like they look so chic and cute like on my shelves or in the basket even in the bathroom So now that I have all my hair done, I'm gonna take out my pony and then just kind of run my fingers through my hair. Kind of shake everything out. Shake it all out. And this is kind of how I would usually just have my hair, just like ready, let's go. But today for the purpose of this video, I want to put on the small, um, I wanna put the skinny clamp, uh, I'm gonna put the skinny clamp, I'm gonna put the skinny, I'm gonna put the skinny barrel on and I'm gonna go back in and just take a few select pieces just so you guys can see the difference between the middle one and the skinny one. 
Okay, we're back. So what I did is there is a little lock that is underneath the clamp, which basically locks in the different barrel that you wanna use. And what I did is, since it kind of takes a few minutes to cool down naturally, I just took a towel, unclamped it, and then put on the skinnier one. And this is, so this is the one inch barrel. And let's kind of just take some pieces and, you know, go in. Get those like tight little cute curls. and see how they turn out. So as you can see, this one comes out a lot tighter curls. And I'm just gonna grab kind of like random pieces in between my hair because I don't want my entire head to be just like <laughs> a super tight curl. kind of gives a little more dimension within the hair so that it's like loose but tousled, but some nice definition. And then I'm gonna repeat that on the other side. So that is pretty much the finished look. I love it. I think adding those like little tight curls gives a little bit more volume if that's what you're looking for. If you have an extra couple minutes to just kind of throw those in and make your hair a little extra and fabulous. Overall, I love the T3. I highly, highly recommend Investing in these products is going to make you feel so good because they are so aesthetically pleasing. They're great quality and I just love how they feel overall. So I would highly recommend them. This was not sponsored. I purchased this item with my own money and I would purchase it again and I highly recommend. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you guys have any questions, please comment them down below. And don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you guys very, very soon. I love you guys. Have a great day.